dog? What's up, buddy? How you doing, man? Good to see you. I was like, hey, that guy's wearing Kuyu. <laughs> I was like, there's, maybe there's a big Kuyu truck. And he's like, waves. And then, and then I was like, that was Sawyer. He's got his camera out already. <laughs> okay, so we uh, just arrived here in Breckenridge, Colorado um, at our Airbnb. It's a beautiful place. It's nice and cool right now, crisp morning. Um, this is a tag that I looked forward to for a long time. I've waited 18 years to draw a goat tag in my home state. And uh, to say that I'm pumped is, uh, is an understatement. So we're really looking forward to getting out there today and glassing for some goats. And hopefully we can turn up a, a big old billy and, and get him killed here in the next couple days. So looking forward to it. Um, just the camaraderie that I'm gonna have with these guys, my cousins here, we got Sawyer here. We're gonna be filming this for the experience. So I'm just pumped to uh, see how it comes out, man. So we just uh, found our first goats here. They're right on the top of a ridge. This one here that I'm looking at looks like a really uh, big body goat. Just judging it from here, it looks like a billy to me. He's got that long face on him. Big, huge, big, huge body and those horns that curve straight back. Yeah, he really looks like a, a pretty nice goat. So we saw the first ones of the, of the hunt, man. That's exciting. Now we know what we're looking at and they look a lot bigger than what I thought they were gonna be. <laughs> so yeah, just gonna watch them, see what they do, and try to get a gauge on them. Maybe make a game plan on them. You're fine. Oh, uh, so uh, we run into a little bit of trouble here. We've got a flat tire and uh, we don't have a compressor. We don't have a jack. Um, so we tried to light it on fire to get it to pop. Now we're gonna put a strap around the tire to try to keep whatever air is in there in there, but we're 10 miles from the truck. So I'm not sure how this is gonna turn out. Um, we're gonna maybe stay the night up on the mountain and what are you doing? Yeah, see what happens. Maybe make some phone calls when we can. Uh, are you guiding right now? Okay, perfect. Um, well, let me take this information, um, put it into our system. Let me send out a, a call to our, uh, our recovery folks and see if we can't have a team to you. Yeah, from... Yep, bye-bye. Dude, how did I find that? Okay, so, up, update. <laughs> it is now 5.54. We limped this thing out of the hole where we thought we were dead in the water and uh, called a couple buddies that nobody's around to be able to help us out. The tire's completely off the rim now. And so uh, my cousin Phil found a four x four rescue company that can actually bring us a spare tire. Uh, we don't know when that's gonna happen. It could be tonight. We hope it's tonight. If it's if not, we may be spending the night and uh, turn the heater on in the, in the rig and hopefully we'll get down tonight. If not, we'll get down tomorrow. So we're uh, at uh, a rental place today getting a, a tire, a spare tire. So what happened last night can't happen again today. Now we're headed to Big O to get it on and then we're gonna be going on here soon.
kind of think that this is probably a billy we should probably shoot, so we're gonna walk down there. They're about 500 yards now. I think we can get to three, 200, 200 or 300 pretty easy, so we're gonna go try to get a shot on him and, and see what he looks like. So yeah, we're headed there now. it's just about who you're with um, and the experience of hunting. Um, I've killed mountain goats in the past um, and this isn't my biggest goat by any stretch of the means but uh, he's my one and only uh, Colorado goat and uh, I'm super proud of him and um, just pumped to be here. Uh, it's a new unit we didn't know anything about it didn't do any scouting and uh, sometimes you just got to take what the mountain gives you so yeah I'm super happy with this guy man. Thanks to Sawyer for getting it all on film. Uh, thanks to my cousin Phil for being here and uh, just being moral support and uh, yeah man we'll just uh, keep going uh, thanks to the experience for everything they've done for me